Well, good morning, folks, and welcome back. This is the beginning of episode two of the cedar log bed. What I have here is the uh, log I'm going to use for the uh, footboard. I've already got it marked off somewhere. Yeah, right here, about 37 inches. And then I've got it marked off again for another 37 inches, but I'm going to, obviously, I'm, I'm going to have to recheck that once I get the first section cut. Anyhow, I'm going to get this started. Um, just, to, just to get the boring stuff out of the way, I'll cut this and then uh, get it cleaned up like I did the last ones. But uh, I'll keep you uh, keep you in the, involved in the loop. And I'm going to get started, so I'll see you shortly. All right, time to bring you back in. I have uh, got the cleaning done. And I'm getting ready to uh, grind off those little jewels right there. There's some there, and of course this one here's got more. And it shouldn't, shouldn't take too long. Kind of round this top out a little more. And uh, set them aside and start on the other piece. So I'll bring you back shortly. All right, that's uh, one bed post all ground down, bringing that color back. Kind of rounded off the edges a little bit. Ooh, help to keep the phone lined up with the bed post. Here's where it was burned a little bit. Anyhow, that's the uh, bed uh, footboard. Bed post number one complete. Okay, here's the next one, and it might take a little bit longer because it's got some larger branch pieces to be ground down. So, anyway, I'll get started and I'll bring you back when I get this one done. It shouldn't take, well, it may take a while. Who knows? Well, won't know till I get started, so I'll see you shortly. Okay, there's the second bed post for the footboard. It's done. Done, ready to go. Well, there's a side to it that had some rot, and I managed to, to get it out of there. So I was able to save the piece of wood, and then I just need to here later on just lightly sand it with some 220 just to kind of smooth it down and then uh, put the clear coat on it and call it good. But, uh, that's going to look nice. Alright, I'll get started on the next piece and I'll bring you back. Okay, this is what I'm planning on using as the decorative portion of the footboard. I'm going to bring all them big, that's going to look beautiful, I think. Get all that cleaned up. And uh, that'll be part of the, like I said, the middle section of the footboard. And it'll be uh, attached to uh, a log, some smaller logs to join the two. Uh, bed post together but uh, I'm going to get this cleaned up and we'll see what it looks like. Bring you back shortly.
All right, folks, here's the center section of the footboard. I got it uh, cleaned up pretty good, and I'm fixing to grind off all them uh, big uh, ratty branches and things. But that cleaned up pretty. I had an area of rot that I was able to, uh, to get out of there and actually salvage this. This is going to make a really nice centerpiece on that footboard. Anyhow, I'm going to get uh, get back to work, and I'll bring you back when I get the uh, get the thing cleaned up. All right, so here's what we got so far. I've been uh, grinding away on it, and this is going to be this is the one that I've been working the hardest on. And there's a reason why I'm grinding that out. But anyway, it's cleaning up good. It's going to it's going to make a really really pretty centerpiece. So anyway, I thought I'd bring you back real quick. And then I'm going to get back on it. All right, folks, here we go. This is the, uh, the decorative end of the footboard. I've got it cleaned up, ground down, ready to be used. There's some th areas I'm going to have to seal and, uh, you know, fit it in. But once I get that done, figure out how I'm going to do this. Should go pretty quick. Anyhow, well, that's going to do it uh, for today. I've got to start. Uh, I got to get a shower and get ready for work. I got uh, swing shift ahead of me, so anyhow, this this part's done. I can now uh, tomorrow I'll mow the lawn and stuff. So I'll take a break from this and kind of collect my thoughts on putting that together. And uh, we will catch you uh, shortly.